It's Nock. Welcome along to a rare lunchtime stream. It's been a while since I've done one of these. Been pretty darn busy just recently. Um, and yeah, these are going to be sort of few and far between going forwards. But I got, actually got some free time today. So I thought, you know what? I need to use a dinner hour for anything else. Let's stream some Portal. And I'm actually going to play... Should we... Get this up over here. There we go. Uh, I'm actually going to play the map that LB streamed the other day because um, uh, I know Joe Pez. I can never say the name. Um, makes um, tricky maps for sure, and um, I thought, you know what, I'll give that one a go. So I stopped um, watching LB's uh, playthrough of it, added it to my uh, not allowed to watch yet queue, and here we are. This is aftermath. So two chambers, tomb chamber map in an overgrowth style of increasing difficulty, medium to hard. And um, yeah, I know LB's uh, playthrough of it was about an hour or so, maybe a bit more than an hour. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to solve it. But without further ado, let's jump in some live pull action, which is something we don't really see a lot of these days from me. Anyway. I uh, hope you're well, if anybody is there. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Exciting stuff. Come on, Murdracker. I realise I've got like... I've got so much ring on my PC right now. I've got Visual Studio 2010 open because I was looking at an old project. I've got Visual Studio 20, 2017 open. I've got Photoshop open. Let's close some of this stuff. That's not going to... That's not going to help me, uh, my machine, much is it? Run nice and efficiently and smoothly. All right, there we go. Thank you, Dory. Alrighty then. It's a nice little sound effect right there. Hey, Bee Master, what's going on, buddy? Hope you are well. It's lagging a bit. I don't know why we're. I don't know why we're lagging. How's it going, Bee? been up to nothing good all right so this is an intro <laughs> this is the first one I've done probably in about three weeks I've just been so busy and I've been focusing my all my attention on um, recording portal maps for YouTube and, and playing games and, and doing other bits and pieces uh, made some life changes as well which um, kind of a bit of a detrimental effect on that as well but um, yeah this is the first live stream in about three weeks at this time of day. So, um, yeah, the only live streams I've been doing are some of my, it's all right, my hammer mapping live streams. All right, so what do we got here? Somewhere where we can get momentum. This seems a bit jittery. I don't know what's going on there. Without restarting portal. May have to put up with that. Okay. Can't see anything over there. Can get over to here. Uh, there's a light bridge there that's activating something. We still have the funnel here. And here. It's, there's debris over the freaking antline, man. Looks pretty freaking cool. Uh, so that is. That one through there, possibly. Alright, so how are we going to get started? Let's take a look at that first. Let's take a look. That's a thing we can do. Not that it... I can't really see that that helps me a lot at this point. I'm not sure why I would want to store momentum either. I mean, I guess that would make sense, but we don't have a... There's no portal surface at the moment to which we can actually 
use that from. We definitely can't just grab the cube. So how are we going to get started? How does one get started? Maybe I should have just watched LB's playthrough. <laughs> uh, maybe that's a thing I should have just done. But where's the fun in that, hey? <clears throat> Excuse me. Yep, not seeing what to do here. Not seeing how to get started. It's not a, um, that's not a portable surface there, is it? No, that is not. So one thing I could do would be to that which kind of gives me height what good would that be though not sure that would do me any good whatsoever but hey can't walk on the uh, rather nice looking BTS stuff now we're funnel flying, which definitely is not good. Oh man. Oh. Uh, well then. That seems like a thing that I have just done. Is that meant to be... I'm meant to be able to fall there? I just... I don't know. It kind of makes sense to be able to pull here though, right? Fall through and get up to there. Okay, I'm going to consider this progress, and I'm going to save. So, next up, light bridge here. Uh, so. Actually, before we get the light bridge, we're going to want the cube. Yeah, cube is going to be more helpful than light bridge. At this moment in time. Because without the cube, we can't actually use the laser. Hmm. All right, I just want to. 
try something here. Ooh. 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 Alright, so. Realize, well, I did that like a really difficult way, didn't I? Jeez. I'd be a lot quicker if I'm gonna do make that work. Oh, that's death. We don't want death. Too early. Holy crap, come on. Too late. Too late again. Nope, I got it. All right, so. Don't know if that's intended. Really don't know if that's intended or not. But now we can do things and stuff and stuff and things. So next up we're gonna go over here. And I wanna do something along the lines of this. That's why. That's why the grating here is different to allow you to step back to place the cube. Did wonder about that. And then we do something along the lines of that. Gives a live bridge. Sure, well and good. But we're going to want to get to the other side first. Oh, let me think about this. Well, why do I need to do that? Because... I need to reverse funnel, that's right. I have a feeling we need to use this room to store momentum. Alright, let's go back. Also got really used to the orange funnel now as well, so something we should maybe keep in mind. All right, so we'll go around here. Ah, there we go. There is a light bridge here. That is progress. Okay, so that's going to allow us to go back. Oh. Oh dear. It's on the timer. On a timer. Ha. All right, so OK, 
Okay. I have an inkling. Problem is, I think there's a big problem here actually. I now don't have a way to re reverse the funnel, do I? Or do I? Maybe I do. Maybe I do. Okay. So, now all I need to do is... I think I got this. This bit, anyway. If I reverse the funnel... Sorry. Move the forward funnel, sorry. Then I do that. Followed by that. door is open. Alright. It is a multi-chambered map, so that is the first bit done. Can I... Weird. Nope. Can't jump over. We have lost everything. That's fine. Okay. So... This is chamber number two. And again, it said medium hard, so... Dropper, which is kind of a little bit weird. It's offset like that, but hey-ho. All right, so that is our exit requirement. Kind of a bit similar. So I'm going to have to have a funnel pushing a cube into the button. That's fine. There's an open area down there. So we can actually access the two areas simultaneously. Oh, hey, look at that. You fell on my head. You bashed it. Okay. We don't want the funnel, right? Hey, would you look at that? We got ourselves a cube. I'll put that cube there. So now we have a way that we can funnel ourselves back up to the top. Which is all well and good. Um, so. What we're going to want to do here. I kind of have a feeling that everything we're going to want to do is going to be want to be from up here. Interesting textures there. 
on the grating, like different coloured. Now I kind of wonder, do we need to have the cube flinging So we'll go over here. Let's go over here first. And then what if we did something like this, per se? Jump through here. Is going to require though a cube respawn. So I need to make sure this portal surface is kind of like directly or as close as can be. Oh, there should be good. Okay, so now we can do, can do this, but. But, 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 but. A. We are nowhere near that surface. And that is, I think that's why this layout is intentionally like this. No, oh, I've lost my momentum. Yeah, I think that's why it's laid out intentionally like that. So, saying that, we could probably... Oh, we can't. Alright, let's try this again. Wow, there was a time where I was rubbish at air strafing. Check that out. Alright, so now I have this. Okay. This is now a thing I have done. So now what I think I need to do I know this it's gonna kind of seem a little bit finicky, but now what I need to do is air strafe back towards the start of the funnel. So, I'm safe here. And that's why I save. I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. See, I did that air strafing so well the first time. Second time, it was nowhere. It was rubbish. Okay, we're through. This is going to be the tricky bit. Gotta be very careful not to end up in the funnel here. All right. That was kind of good to me. F6. Now what I really want to happen is this cube. Is that cube needs to go through the funnel and into the funnel. Through the funnel and into the funnel. Great terminology, knock. But what I should probably do actually is I could do it from here. It makes sense to do it from this side, right?
Oh, but wait a second. Oh, no. Hold on. I kind of forgot a key part of this, didn't I? Which is... <sighs> yeah, I, I forgot the key part, which was... Sorry, doing that and that and that and dropping that into there, but I haven't actually got... haven't actually got the portal on the funnel, so I can't use the funnel if the portal's not there. It's kind of a bit of a fundamental error on my part, I guess. Okay. So, let's reverse a minute. I think I know how I could do this. Alright, so, so something like that it gets away from the funnel for a start. Okay. So I don't need to worry about this cube, actually. What I need to do is I need to get back to where I was before, near the button. That's what, that's what I'm going for here. So, let's make sure we are underneath this dropper again, before we start on our travels. Across the map again we go. Okay, so now what I'm going to do here, something like this, drop into the funnel, cube comes up, cube goes down, cube comes up, we go up, and then we do a final portal shot there. Alright, I restricted myself via the dropper. Oh, did I not save after that? Oh, jeez. Alright, save here. Oh my goodness. Back we go again. Right. You're actually kidding me. You know, what, let's start this game. Because it's just sugar. We had coffee everywhere then, that would have been good. Oh, you penis. <sighs> okay. In here. In there. In there.
Boom. We be done. Um. I don't know if that's intended, though. That's my only thing. I don't know if that is intended. Nice video. I like that. Alright, well, I guess the only way we'll find out whether or not that is intended is by watching LB's playthrough back later, I guess. But, um, no. Good map. Um, good puzzles. Good puzzles. Um, both similar in that you need to use that funnel uh, for the exit. But, um... I was a bit worried when I saw that extremely long timer, if I'm completely honest, uh, in the first chamber. How he's added to his favourites. Is there a walkthrough? All right, let's have a look. Let's have a look. The official solution. Okay. Let's check. Did we do it right? Okay, yep, we know about that. Showing us the map. Hit the button. Hit the cube. Funnel back up to the top. Seems like we did do it correctly. Yeah, if, you, um, if you're a bit quicker than I am, uh, obviously you can hit that all in one go and not have to wait so long. But no, it's cool. I solved it correctly. Huzzah. Add it to my favourites. That was a good map. So yeah, that didn't actually take as long as I thought. We've been going for 34 or 30 minutes and um, we're already that map down. So since we are here, let's... Um, let's plough through some of um, Flooper's map, shall we? We've got an another... 40 minutes or so. It's all good. Chamber 00, zero and High Advanced. Uh, another recreation of Portal, just with a little twist. Uh, okay, let's see what we got here then, shall we? Normally, Portal recreations aren't particularly great, but we'll see. Okay. Oh wow, could you could you make me take like any longer way to get where I need to go here? Also, the amount of glass and stuff that's in this map is um, is quite off-putting, actually. I kind of got a little bit turned around, but I guess that's what you were going for. And... Okay. Is that it? Are we done? All right, we're done. Yeah, kind of like another one of those, um, another maze map, I kind of guess. So, um, yeah, anyway. Let's go on to Chamber 01, High Advanced. And this one says... Uh, another recreation of Portal with just a little twist. It took me four hours to build this one. Alright. Let's see what we've got this time then. Uh, it doesn't look like we're ever going to come back up here again. Right, so we have momentum area there.
Alright, so. That's horrible. Why'd you do that, Flooper? Why, god damn it. Okay. That's the thing that we now did. That's the thing that I now did. But are any of these things that I now did useful to me? Probably not. I want the cube here, right? So... Let's recall that a minute. You know what? Give me a new cube. Oh, come on. Come on. That's the only thing I can think to do. I mean, it took me a while to get there, but... I have somebody do that. I don't really do anything for us anymore. So we can do this. Why is that thing? Alright, so basically I need to press this button first. Then I go and do this. Oh. I didn't actually see that there. So then I can just do that. Well...
Well, <laughs> oh dear. There we go. Yeah, a bit, a bit finicky at the end there, but ah, uh, what was this map dated? Uh, this was 2015. I don't know when Flooper started making maps. I guess these are still relatively early in the Flooper map making process. All right, next up we got continue testing. Looks like there is some hammer work in this one. Let's unsubscribe from that one. Unsubscribe from that one. Unsubscribe from that one. All right, continue testing. Hi guys. Hey guys. That's a new map by me. I'm. Oh, I've always created maps with Hammer Editor. I hope you. I, I've always created the map. I've created the map with Hammer Editor. Uh, I hope you enjoy my little test, and please write us comments if anything doesn't work. That's just evil. Just, wh why would you do that to me? That's just pure evil. Oh, really? Oh, you want me to do it in thing? Gotcha. Here we go. And all right, so what the delay on that fizzler? What was that all about? Where am I meant to go? Maybe I'll just do this instead. Oh! <laughs> oh, yeah, let's do this one. This one makes lots more sense. Yeah, but there's a lay on that fizzler, man. <sighs> Ninjamoves.com. Ninjamoves.com. There we go. Oh, I've got to do it all in one motion, haven't I? Damn it! Ah, uh, okay. Well, you know, early maps. Early maps. GLaDOS Escape. Uh, okay. GLaDOS Escape. Maybe. All right, more hammer work here. Let's take a look. Escape from Gladys, or you will die. Okay. Uh, Joe Library is the next map, and hey guys, this map was built to one hundred percent with, so it was built in Hammer. Um, the goo is a little bit glitchy. Okay, the glue is a little bit glitchy. So is the. Um, the lighting and the compile settings by the looks of it. Oh. I don't like to comment too much on hammer maps, but um, yeah, there's you could do with some variation on textures. The reason I don't like to comment too much on hammer maps is because um, I've been trying for a long time to finish a hammer map and publish a hammer map, 
and um, I am yet to succeed. So I don't really want to criticize other people, but um, yeah. Um, texture variation. That is what is required right there. Uh, okay. These are relatively straightforward, simple maps, it seems. Uh, next. He can see you. Who's he? Who is he? Hey guys, here is another map from me, Building Hammer. Hope you enjoy the test. Uh, maybe Cave can see us. So I think, right there, good sir. You have got some no draw texture. I can see that through the window. Your observation room is not meeting the, uh, the actual test chamber wall here. Uh, anywho, uh, we have a laser. Uh, okay, so we got up here. Cave Johnson here. I see you. I see your little feet. <laughs> but cut off your hair and put it on your feet and eat your little hair. What? Oh, and feet. Mmm. Uh, okay, okay, thanks for that. Uh, literally, is that all I need to do? Uh, I guess it is. So what was what was over here again? There's another cube there. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna actually downvote that one. That one's a bit rubbish. I know some of these, obviously, Flooper are going to be like from when, like, you know, I keep saying it from like back in your early mapping days, but yeah. All right, anyway, uh, next up we have got Laser Connection 1. This is another map from me. Hope you enjoy the puzzle. Have fun. Okay. Does it keep spawning? It does. Uh, no need, really need for the, the button there. <coughs> Excuse me. Sure, I'll go up here. Alright, so we got a lot of freaking stuff going on here. Do we need the laser for anything right now? Doesn't look like it. Maybe we should go and get that cube. This kind of reminds this is reminiscent of the um, bit from campaign. You guys know which bit I'm talking about. It's uh, one of the uh, GLaDOS chambers. I think it's isn't it the one where Wheatley puts the bird into the elevator? I'm rubbish with names, so don't ask me what the name is. Right, again, does that does that keep spawning? I do believe it does. I guess I'd say we'll probably do that. Um, what did that do? Triangle. Where is the triangle, y'all? Yeah? Oh, that's a light bridge. No signage on triangle for some reason. Let's try something like 
this. Um, what did X do? What did X do? Are we any wiser as to what X did? Hmm. I guess not. Oh, maybe we should go up here. Maybe, just maybe, that would help our cause. Just a suggestion. Uh, where am I exactly? I'm just here for here. That's fine. I... What am I doing? Thank you. I, I don't know what I'm doing, generally. I don't even know what that button does. What's that button do? I'm going to do something through there. I guess I'm going to need that, like, on there, perhaps. And then, then what? Well, I'm going to need to get it back. Uh, I'm going to need to get it back, but I do believe I have just created possibly a trapping situation. Oh, no. We've got another cube. We're okay. We're okay. Could have been a trapping situation if I hadn't left that cube on the button, though. Oh, I don't want to put it on there anymore. Clearly. Ha! Huh. Alright. Plot one. So what is that needed for? There goes... What I actually need for the exit, more more importantly. What about exit requirements here. One thing I've noticed with um, your older maps is that there's a lot of and the and lines are very difficult to to follow. So downwards triangle opens that. That was downwards triangle. What does this one do? I don't even know what this one does. This one goes there, goes around there, there. And opens that, but I don't need, don't need that anymore, right? So I can take that one away safely. Okay. Dot and moon. Where's dot and moon? It's X. Do something like this, maybe? I don't want to do that, that's for sure.
Yeah, it doesn't seem right. Where are those other two connections? Ready. I have no idea. There is so much here that I can't even see what is required and what's not required for this. This is crazy. That button is required for that. Oh, then I have to do this again. So I don't know if that's required. I don't think that's required. But I generally don't know. That's one thing. We also need... That. We also need... That. So we need square. And... We also want that as well. Yeah, this is very confusing. Very, very confusing. Hey, Aaron, what's going on? Only since today I had a bit of spare time, and I was like, "Hey, let's let's do a stream. Let's do a stream and things and stuff." What's going on, buddy? Hope you're well. This is a very confusing map, though, unfortunately. So, the only thing to do, we do this, right? Which would kind of be a bit clever. I heard another cube spawn. So I'll go there and there and there. Hey, that area's opened up. Would you look at that? Now I can do this. I don't know where that cube's spawning, man. Where is that cube spawning? That is. It's a very difficult map to follow, unfortunately. Um, Antlines, uh, it's just a mess, antline wise. Um, not particularly enjoyable because you got these connections down here, but you can't actually see or track what they're going to or going to and from clearly without no clipping. So, um, yeah, not, not the best layout in my opinion, unfortunately, but. Um, you know what, it, it's, I, again, early maps. Um, my 
Oh, so the next puzzle is no good. My early maps are just as terrible. Um, Lee Smith, also known as DJL, was um, actually published one of my early maps yesterday. And I was like, dude, why don't play this? This is awful. <laughs> it was really awful. Um, but yeah, I mean, we, we all kind of, we all learn and have to start somewhere, I guess. Right, anyway, uh, so that one's can't play. That one is broken. And laser connection three it is then. Uh, time for a couple more maps and then I'll have to call it a day. So this is laser connection three. Which I have already played. Which I have already played. So let's skip to the next test. Uh, work stuff's good, mate. Work stuff is good. Uh, I've actually been working on another project just recently, like uh, I've also played that one, so let's skip to the next. Um, been working on a uh, password generation tool. Maybe I'll sh show you it later. Uh, anyway, this is uh, Lightbridge Puzzle version 3.1. Um, hi guys, new. This that's the new version. Better sounds, better lighting, and better environment. Hope you enjoy it. Built with Hammer. Yeah, uh, Lee kind of was playing one of my, my you'll probably remember B Master. My early maps were like a load of maze maps and they were just absolutely awful. I felt so sorry for him when he was playing them. I uh, know it's not a random string generator, Aaron. It's, um, is that a toggle ball? No. Uh, basically, it's a, it uses um, a dictionary API um, called WordNix. So it goes off, it gets the random things. And then it creates a secure password based on a predefined config. So, uh, yeah, we can basically, you can have multiple configs. I'll, I'll show you later. All right, so we have cube. Because cube and button bane testing remains an important part. Why? I was about to say, why is the library moving? But, yeah, that makes total sense. All right, let's go over here. We have some um, foliage. Destroyed aperture confirmed. And right, so. Trying to move through here. see what you want me to do here. Going up. Two seconds. Alright guys. Sorry about that. Alright, so that was um that was a, a fail. Maybe I need to be quicker. So maybe I need to leave this. Oh, I don't know about there. Run down here. And then we're going to try and be a bit quicker about this. So try. There we go. Q weird sound effects. It's like the place can like, like the place can like burn down or something. Thank you for your participation. Triumphant. Well you've blocked me in. Uh, all right, so let's get rid of some of these again. Next up, we are going to play line, which looks interesting. So, no, it wasn't line. Uh, 
Uh, what was that puzzle in? I have no idea what that puzzle was. Who knows? All right, line is next then. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, part one of five. There are five parts of this map, apparently. Uh, what are we doing for time? Uh, about 10 minutes left. Uh, I didn't say anything, no, Aaron, don't worry. You miss nothing. It's like it's going to be like a gradual progression kind of map. Uh, it's fry up day for me today, so I had um, egg, bacon, and beans. Probably the wrong person to ask if you're after inspiration, though. I don't really vary breakfast that much. I don't have it all the time. I do have cereals sometimes. So... I assume I'm still kind of going the right way. I, I generally don't know at this moment in time. Maybe I'm meant to go this way now. Uh, normally if I have anything different, I have like... Um, it's normally cereals I, I would have. So either cornflakes, um, something like... Uh, Oh, what do you call them? Because we don't get brand stuff. Um, shreddies. Uh, Weedabix. Things like that. That's my kind of normal sort of thing I would get. What was the point of that button? What was the point of the light bridge? What was the point of like that hole of the side? What's the point of all this stuff? I don't know. What's all this stuff? What? Flooper. Alright, oh, yeah, no worries. I'll oh, catch you later. I guess it's all just like BTS kind of stuff to make it look like it's bigger than it actually is. I um, mean, you, you could get the companion cube. Oh, I see what you meant to. You meant to funnel. So, alright, so when we was here, instead of going that way, I was meant to go here. And. Here, I believe. Which would then allow me to get the companion cube. And then do that so I can go backwards. Which I'll make shinch. And then we plop that on there like so. Uh, 
and then we would navigate the maze, blah 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 blah, and destroy the companion cube because why not? Um, here's one I made earlier. Thank goodness. Yeah, and then this opens this. And we find the hidden... It's almost like we're inside the companion cube with the love hearts on the wall. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, still unsure, however. What I was meant to do with that light bridge. Why I would want the light bridge. Gives me like a little stepping platform, I guess. I don't know. Possibly. Maybe uh, in the description you should mention about the quest with the uh, companion cube blooper. Just a, a tip. All right, one more. Let's play one more. And it is... Secured. Man, we've burned through some maps today, haven't we? I didn't expect to solve the, uh, the first one quite so quickly, to be fair, after LB took over an hour with it. But, hey. Sometimes you see it, sometimes you don't. All right, point to it. Be gone. Let's read the description. High secured. It's all we can. I'll take you. Uh, what did you do exactly? You did something down there. Okay. I get the impression that these stairs may collapse. I'll go that way. Go this way, but it resets our progress. Must be a emancipation grill there. It's gonna fling me into death, so I should probably not go that way. Um Not entirely sure where I need to be going. That works. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. That wasn't good. That didn't quite work out. I wanted it. And it cost it to save, so. I don't know where I'm going now. Oh, you piece of... Please do not do that. Thank you. Let get in there. Now I need to go around here. Ah, oh, surprise. Uh, I can't go that way. I remember now. I remember. I didn't really.
Right, back around we go. La la la. la. Of course you're going to do that to me. Of course. I didn't expect anything else, to be fair. That's where that comes in. Alright, so... Do this first. I'm talking about going around. Talk about going around in circles. Please, I saved it. I don't think I did. Teach me right, won't it? Serve me right. There's a lot of flipper maps. Alright, I think I know what to do this time. I think I know what to do. It's okay. It's all, it's all good. It's all good. <sighs> Just gotta get around the maze first. Oh, you piece of... <laughs> no! Ah, oh, dear. Oh, well, the thing is, though, I'm like... Because I kind of feel like I know what I need to do, I'm rushing through it and I'm making stupid mistakes. Stupid mistakes. Are you kidding me? I saw those and moved away from those at exactly the same time. How can one still be on the freaking sentry mode? That was stupid. As you wish. say coming through before. That's a bit of a new one on me. Alright, so where am I going now? Back up the stairs.
cube. Drop us the cubeth downeth. Through here. Back around. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, so this is the bit. Problem is, though, it's all good and well doing that. I still have the same. I still have the same issue, right? I need to put this on here and then go like all the way back around almost. Oh, that's death. Oh. Did I just like absolutely overlook that last time? I believe I may have done. Wow, yeah. Overcomplications.com Brought to you by Knox Skitney. Uh, I don't know, I still feel like some of the stuff there wasn't needed or wasn't used. Maybe I broke it. Probably I broke it. I don't really know. Guys, thank you very much for tuning in, though. Um, hope you enjoyed... Um, hope you enjoyed some of these maps. Um, if you did, let me know. I'll be back. I don't know when. I don't want to be back, guys. Um, because, like I said, the, the lunchtime streams haven't really been um, factoring in just recently. So if I get another chance, I will certainly stream... Um, if not, make sure you go check me out on youtube.com forward slash nscholars. Thanks for tuning in there, guys. I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Happy gaming. <laughs>